Hi, I'm a Ruby on Rails developer in Singapore, and I'm going to give you a, a course on how to develop a single web application using Ruby on Rails 4. And uh, in this very first episode, I'm going to teach you how to install Ruby on Rails on your local machine, and uh, um, also introduce my development environment. So to install Ruby on Rails on your local machine, I use the uh, Ruby version manager. Um, so what you need to do is go to the RVM uh, official website and then copy this link, open your terminal, and uh, you paste there, append it with dash dash uh, rails to install it. Then after installing that, uh, let me introduce my dot file repository on github.com. So uh, this is this repository almost contain all my configurations uh, of my system. So um, it's very easy using this uh, repository to set up a fresh new Linux environment. So you just need to follow the instructions down here, and uh, you can set up the environment, which contains configuration of uh, Git, um, IRB. Tmax, uh, Vim, and uh, uh, Omedash. So please ensure that you have um, Tmax and uh, Omedash installed on your computer. So after installing my dot files, uh, I will introduce you uh, some of the cool and uh, interesting plugins I use for Vim. Let me open my Mac Vim, and uh, I will use this. Uh, I will use this one as an example. So uh, let me first show you the plugins inside of the Vim. Uh, so the sidebar on the right left side is uh, a sidebar to navigate through your project. And uh, mm, I use control P dot Vim to navigate to any of the files inside of the project. So you just press Ctrl and P. Uh, suppose I want to go to index.html. There, I, I have navigated to index.html. And um, uh, this one is tabular. So uh, what tabular can do is, for example, I have a list of uh, countries and uh, the short name of the countries. Uh, China, CN. Singapore, SG, United States, US. So uh, I want to format this um, this table like text. So I can use uh, the tabular by pressing column, uh, tab, slash, and uh, column, and enter. So it can um, tableize this text. That, that's what tabular can do. Okay. Um, next one I want to introduce is a Vim color scheme switcher. So you just press uh, F8 to navigate through your favorite color schemes. I got uh, more than 400 color schemes here. And uh, Vim easy motion. Uh, you know that uh, navigate in one file in Vim is not that easy, but using uh, easy motion, you press your Vim uh, leader key, which uh, mine is the default backslash, backslash uh, W. So uh, for example, I want to go here, I press Y and uh, O, then I can go to anywhere inside this file I want using easy motion. Indent guide is uh, is a plugin that can show the indentation guidelines. So default key is uh, leader ig uh, backslash ig. So backslash ig again to toggle this one. And um, mm, Vim surround. Vim surround. Uh, for example, I want to uh, surround this part of code with a div tag. So I first select it in visual mode, 
and uh, press Shift S and start typing the div tag with class equals to container. There you go. You have uh, surrounded this one. Okay, uh, that's all for this episode. From next episode, I will teach you how to make a Facebook-like uh, simple web application using Rails 4 and uh, using the skills we, we have discussed today. Thanks for watching.